Hey guys, my name is Mzedaro Dondwa. Good afternoon. Today we're going to be focusing on PCP, Principle of Computer Programming. This is our interface whereby we're going to have two public functions, one for average, one for status, and then the code will also put it on the button calculate. So now let's put the public function with our click on the form. Now we set public function. Okay. Allowing me to type in the wrong place. We come to end sub and then we go down. We say public function. Public function. Okay, the first public function is gonna be for our calc of AVG. Okay. Calc AVG inside. We're gonna Put our max that are in changes so int m one s integer and then by val int m two s integer by val int m three which is max s integer and all these will come out as decimal and then now we say return we return what we return the return it's on the formula let me check it okay in mark one okay plus in mark two this int int mark three divide by three so now let's come to our second public function okay public function now the second one we call it decision Decision here, yeah, gonna be making some decision by val. Okay, deck AVG S decimal, but will return string. I'll explain that as we go down. Let's start with our formula dim str status s string the reason why we are saying string is because pass and fail are words and are not numbers but they will be determined by numbers that's why we said deck avg it's a decimal but if the outcome has to be in words that's what we use to strings so now we're gonna use if status statement I mean to say if deck AVG is 14 above then the student has passed right so we are saying st str str status Tell us that the student has passed. Else, else, str status. If not so, str status, the student has failed. Has failed. Okay, don't forget to return me. Eh? Don't forget to return. Now we are returning what str status. Let's see. So let's come back to our button calculate, and then we declare team all of this int mark one, int mark two, int mark three, 
obviously as an integer now let's declare the second one team str status stay just let us as a watch stream question let's also declare the one for our average deck avg is decimal question zero okay now let's assign this integer dot try page okay let's first one text box one text one dot text it's matching with int mark one perfecto let's come with the second one integer uh, dot try pass so you are following this we're doing the same thing until the, the third one int mark two okay integer the try pass txt array the text int m3 we're then assigning now we are calling the function now deck avg equals to what was the name that we used there when we call that public function it was calc what calc avg calc avg yes <coughs> okay now on calc avg we have three max int m1 int m2 in int m3 okay str status request okay decision we call it decision that public we only have one item which is deck avg okay now i think we'll be done we have to go for for, for what for 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 displaying the lbl average dot text then it was to and this one we're gonna put deck avg dot to stream yeah, yeah. and then the second one it's lb state lbl status text equals to str status okay let's debug it and see if it's gonna work oh okay it's read okay let's put the, the first test marks it's 88 second one is 23 fourth one is 45 calculate now oh, the student has failed the average is 35 what if on the second test the student may be caught 57 oh the student has passed the average is 46 the code for clear and the exit i've already given them you check on the previous tutorials if you have any question on pcp principle of computer programming let me know i'll come back and answer them thank you for watching this tutorial god bless you